Welcome sa sipnahin.com uh, In this video ay magsistart tayo ng panibagong series of problem solving no? Ang series na to ay magdi-discuss ng mga mixture problems So this is the first video Kaya siguro dahan-dahan lang muna natin uh, I-introduce yung mga different concepts na involved sa uh, pagsasolve ng mixture problems Now these two problems ay hindi naman talaga sila yung nakikita nyo sa libro no? But then Uh, ito yung pinakapundasyon no? ng pag-aaralan natin. So, let's start with the first example. How many milliliters of alcohol does an 80 milliliter supposed to be? Supposed to be an, an 80 milliliter mixture if it contains 12% alcohol. So, dito meron tayong 80 milliliter na, mix, na mixture. No? 80 milliliter na mixture. At 12% noon ay alcohol. Ibig sabihin, may, may nag-mix tayo ng alcohol and another liquid, no? But we are not concerned with the other liquids, but uh, we are not concerned with the other liquids. Hindi natin sila kailangan. Ang kailangan lang natin yung purong alcohol, no? Doon sa ating uh, question. So, 12%. 12% na alcohol doon sa 80 milliliters. I think this is very easy, no? So, number one, we have We need 12% of 80, no? So, gagawin lang natin dito, i-convert lang natin ito into decimal, 0.12, and then i-multiply lang natin siya sa 80. Which I think, 12 times 8 is uh, 96. So, dalawang decimal places, 960 pagiging 9.6. So, i-multiply nyo lang using your calculator. So, ibig sabihin, dun sa mixture na 80, meron tayo 9.6 doon na purong alcohol, no? pure alcohol. And the other part, siguro mga dif malamang isa or dalawang liquid or more. No? But we are, again, we are not concerned with those liquid. Number two, what is the total alcohol content of an 80 milliliter mixture containing 12% alcohol and... A 110 milliliter mixture containing 8% alcohol. So, kung mapapansin niyo pareho lang itong requirement dun sa una. 80 milliliter sa 12%. Tapos, meron tayong 110 milliliter na mixture containing 8% alcohol. So, sa 110 na yon times 8%, again, yung 8% natin, i-convert natin siya into mix. Sorry, into decimals, magiging 0.08 siya. No? So, divide natin by 100. So, magiging 110 times 0.08 and that becomes, ilan yan? 880. Tapos, dalawang decimal place. No? So, magiging, o oh, dalawang decimal place, magiging 8.8. So, ibig sabihin, yung, yung unang mixture natin, which is already solved, which was already solved in the, in the, in number one, 9.6, tapos meron tayong 8.8 dun sa pangalawa. So, 9.6 milliliters, no? Plus, this is the total amount of total alcohol, no? O total... volume no volume of pure alcohol so magiging equal siya sa 9.6 plus 8.8 milliliters which is equal to 9.6 times 8.8 14 carry 1 18.4 milliliters so ito lang yung pinakasagot ng ating um, problems no, na sa itaas okay, hope meron kayong natutunan dito and again, this is a prerequisite of the problems that we're going to solve kung sa mga susunod na videos kaya tandaan nyo ito no? um, invite ko kayo sa sip9.com nandyan yung ating mga videos no? so if uh, Pwede rin kayong, if you want to 
watch other videos, you can visit siplayan.com na dyan yung list ng mga uh, sunod-sunod na listahan ng mga to- different topics, no? And of course, if you want to subscribe in YouTube, no? Para kayo yung makatanggap ng email every time na mag- mag-post ako ng bagong video, you can uh, click the subscribe button below the video. Okay, maraming salamat and see you in the next tutorial.